hello everyone hello everyone in today's video will create this expand button it is simple and easy hello everyone in today's video will create this expand button so when we tap on the button you see how it expand and we will make it reusable so every time you can pass in different title and the color thing I need in state called expand and I will delete all this and then a Z stack And to control the spacing between the letters, we do it like 10. For now, we'll start with 5. We have on change and on end on change the first thing happen when we tap on this button expand will be true and on end when we lift our finger from the button let's start easy and make when we tap on the button I want to make the width 300 if expand is true I'll make the width 300 else will be 190 so now we tap on the button I'll make this one zero we need just to add an animation So let's change this value also. If it's true, will be five, else will be ten. And for the height, if it's true, will be twenty-five, else will be fifteen. So now for the text. If it's true, will be 15, else 5. But look to the animation, is something grown. So what we need is just to add the frame to the text. Will be 300 and the height 50. Also, when we tap on the button, you see in here is big space down this side. So to make this button reusable, so we can make it as a button, we need an action. So now we can use this action when we lift our finger. We just come this, we create a new view, we'll name it home view. Also, we can add in the title. I 
and if you want you can add the color also to the right angle So now every time you call the custom button, you should pass in the title, the color, and the action. What we want to happen when we tap on the button. Let's just call the custom button. The title. And the color. And a bit like just white. And the action. 